The C5 cut is actually very similar to the C4 cut we saw in the previous section. In this specific case, we want to recover one of the most important components, which is isoprene. Isoprene is used for synthetic rubbers, latex, and so on. So it is one of the most valuable materials we encounter in the C5 cut. But also, we're going to have, let's say, a brief analysis on all the compounds that you can encounter there. For instance, piperidine, which is a diene. You can also find cyclopentadiene. You can find cyclopentan, cyclopentine, and so on. We're going to see just how it will be typically separated, what are their main uses, and then we end up with the several oxygenated materials. Pretty similar to MTBE in C4 group. In this specific case, we're going to see ETBE, which is ethyl terpetyl ether, and we're going to see also TAME, which is terp amyl methyl ether, also used to increase the octane ratings on the gasoline. Okay, now this is one of the most simplest, or let's say not that complex processes, because it is done also at once or via separations, but it's also important because this is extensively used in the industry. Okay, so I'll see you in the next video.